Hello everyone, Savari Tech here, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install Men in the Middle framework um, for Kali 2022, right? Um, so before I get started, I'd like to address the live boot audience. People who are using live boot do know that you're going to need to update your machine before you run this, so make sure you have enough space to update that. You might want to check uh, this section and the way you check your um, uh, storage space is open the terminal and type um, df dash capital H and on this image here it shows this part where um, where it says available memory so you want to make sure that you have um, at least 10 gigs on available memory for your device where the arrow is pointing right so um if you have that we'll get started and also um i want to point out that if you do not have enough space it'll give you an error um sort of like this but not a big deal so to get started we'll open our terminal and we'll type sudo space su and type my password here. The reason I do that is to permanently go into root mode and I'll type this command here. Dash Y means yes to all the questions they're gonna ask us. Um, I'm gonna let this run for as long as it needs to run to update everything. Um, it might ask you a couple of things, prompts you to say yes or no, or maybe okay, select certain interfaces. But once you got this covered, you're ready to move to the next step. Okay, so we're back. As you can see, a few things have changed. Probably my tone and my voice because it's been a few hours now. And um, also the desktop, I removed some folders that were not really necessary. Um, but go ahead and get the link in the description right it says this and copy it copy that in the description and into your Kali machine you're gonna do right click open terminal here you're gonna type get clone and you're gonna put this the reason it's auto completing is because I sort of run ran this a little bit before the video so I could test things out right I want to give you guys quality stuff and hit enter it should bring two uh, scripts for you in that MITMF for Cali folder, right? And let me explain what's happening, what's going on here. There are two scripts. This one actually is for um, first time use. The first time you install Cali, you're gonna want to um, run this, and any other time you want to use Cali, you're gonna use this one, and I'll show you how to do that, right? Um, for some reason, I don't, I can't really explain it, but for some reason, when I run it as a script, it keeps bugging out with the continue use one. So I'll do what works. I'll open with mousepad, and I'll copy this thing out. I'll copy everything except for the bin slash sh line. If you're good with Kali and you understand how to run scripts, go for it. Um, but for uh, inclusivity purposes I will open this and we'll just like copy pasting go on your desktop after you copy the first time script right open terminal and paste paste selection okay it's not working I'll do control shift V here well would you look at that it works now hit enter and let it run its course now some of you might be asking, why would you uh, write every single PIP install commands on a line, on a separate line? It's because if I install it, if I uh, write the script like this and I put them all on one line, what happens is it tries to run the pip install at one time and if one of those modules fail, it just cuts the installation. So I put them every last one of them on a separate line if one module fail the installation keeps going because for all we know you might not need that module if you actually need it 
find a way to install it, try to like troubleshoot it on the internet, find out what that module is called and all that, right? Um, let's go back there. Probably. Okay, so it installed it. As you could see here, there are some errors. Some modules didn't make it. Pi Crypto is one of them. But let's test this thing out. We're going to do Python 2.7. You have to put 2.7 because um, Men in the Middle Framework was coded in Python 2.7. And you're going to hit enter. Once you do that, boom, you're done. Um, it says you may run MF, MIT MF as root, and every time you want to run something as root, all you have to do is like sudo and run the, whatever you have to run, right? Um, and I like to put sudo su so it says so it stays in that permanent um, um, root stage. Um, but sometimes when you do that as well, it just mess things up because it tries to install things in the root directory. So just do it like I did it in the video because you know that works, right? Um, let's close it here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to run min in the middle for, uh, framework again um, for like another time, right? Just Let's say you just op open your Kali machine and you want to run it again. Um, you're going to open the folder, say open terminal here, and let's try it out. Let's talk about it. See what it did? It threw out an error. And my way to fix that is to use the continued script, right? The one that says da 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 continue use of Aritech, right? And right click open with mouse pad. You could run it as a script, but I'm not gonna do that right now, okay? Because it keeps bugging out for some reason. Copy this, except the bin slash sh thing, right? Copy it, go to the terminal, control shift V and enter. What is happening here is that it is creating a virtual environment. And in, inside that virtual environment, it's also telling it, yo, we're using Python 2.7. Um, and the other thing it is doing is it's installing all those modules again, including PyIInotify, so that it can actually work it again. So that is for any time that you're going to run Men in the Middle uh, framework. In the future, and as you can see here, just Python 2.7 and hit enter, it works. Would you look at that? Um, yeah, so next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna subscribe. <laughs> yeah, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Um, like the video if you really enjoyed it. I had a fun time making this for you, tested it on several different Kali machines, and Stay up with the channel, y'all. Um, I'll keep coming with those videos. All right.